All right, folks, gather round, because something momentous has happened in my life. No, I didn't finally master the Macarena. I got a Mac Mini Pro. And let me tell you, this little powerhouse is so slick, so powerful, it makes me feel like I could edit a blockbuster movie while simultaneously composing a symphony and training a squirrel to fetch my coffee. But then I realized, where do I plug in my other 17 hard drives and my antique USB 2.0 webcam from 2005? Apple, bless their minimalist hearts, gave me a couple of ports. But I'm an artist, a creator, a digital hoarder. I needed more. Well folks, Amazon was nice enough to let me purchase the RayQ Mac Mini M4 Dock. It promises to be the Mac Mini Pro's ultimate wingman. It's secret weapon. It's, well, it's dock. But is it all sunshine and Thunderbolt 5 speeds? Or are there some hidden gremlins lurking within? Let's find out. So why did I, a humble content creator who mostly just uploads videos of their kids playing sports, need a dock for my Mac Mini Pro? Because my friends, the Mac Mini Pro is like that super smart, super athletic kid who also is an introvert. It's got brains and bronze, but it's a little shy with its ports. This RayQ dock is basically its social butterfly, bringing all the connections to the party. It's designed to sit under your Mac Mini, so it's like the quiet, supportive roommate that doesn't steal the spotlight. It mostly matches the Mac Mini's aesthetics, which is good because nobody wants a mismatched tech couple on their desk. It's made out of super sexy machined aluminum. Sounds fancy, like something a robot butler would appreciate. It feels solid, not like it's going to spontaneously combust under pressure, unlike my brain when I'm trying to think about what video to make next. The thermal architecture is supposed to be top notch with custom heat dissipation fins. Basically, it's got gills for keeping cool which is more than I can say for myself during a tight deadline. Now for the main event, the ports. This is where the RayQ really tries to earn its keep. My Mac Mini Pro was feeling a bit lonely with its limited selection, but now it's practically throwing a party. The RayQ has two USB-A 3.2 10 gigabytes per second ports, along with a USB-C for the host connection and more, along with the HDMI and SD micro SD card readers. And now for the big elephant in the room. Some reviews mention Wi-Fi interference. I've experienced none of that. I've had nothing but clean, clear connections and a fantastic experience with this RayQ Mac Mini M4 Pro dock. If you're a port-starved individual like myself, constantly juggling dongles and wishing your Mac Mini had more openings than Swiss cheese, then yes, it's a solid contender. It cleans up the desk, adds much needed storage, and gives you those convenient front-facing ports. Let me know what you think in the comments. And as always, please like and subscribe for more deep and shallow dive tech tips.